everyone welcome back to another playthrough of ac3 uh, we are currently trying to do this Millennium johnson mission that i kept screwing up in the last couple of minutes of my last playthrough um because to get full sync you need to not be detected um and i think i'm seeing something i might be able to take advantage of This path has a stream of brush. I can just swim under the entire time. And now I can just climb up the hill. But I do remember there's a man, a uh, soldier, walking around over there. Luckily I have my bow and arrow so I can do um, a reflective, reflexive. Oh yeah, this is perfect. They can't see nothing. That was the best idea. And there's more brush? Bruh. Perfect. Alright, so we're coming up on Herman. A Herman. A human. Okay, get in the brush. Okay. Okay. Um... Yeah, this is so much easier. Okay, so those are just regular humans. Don't mind me. I wonder if I can climb this. I'm not seeing anyone. Not going half bad for the most part thus far. Now, mm, it would be nice if I could get in the trees. <laughs> like we are not your brothers. <laughs> I'll see if I can get this person's attention. Perfect. Oh man, got no one coming. <sighs> Good thing you turned around right at that moment. That worked out. No, get back in there. Get. What? If, oh, I know why. It's a stupid um thing where if they notice you at all, your height, the hiding won't work. I'm using I can get up on this tree. Well, this tree didn't get me much, but I, at the very least, I can get a better idea of um, where folk be at. No, nothing else. Okay, so there is a guy <sighs> over here who's walking back and forth. I need to get rid of him. Or I can just time it. Just 
so that while both these guys are walking away, I'm running this way and climbing up to where I need to be. I think that's what I'm going to do. Like now. Oh, shit. You can't climb it. Okay, so we have to go up the hill. Shoot. Shoot. Get in the bush. So... Hmm. Maybe I just do a reflective shot. Nope. He detected me. Man! All that. Alright. I mean, it's okay. We have a better plan now. I'm glad I looked over to my left. Yeah, whatever. Okay, going this way. This like this path worked perfectly for a while. So, hmm. had that guy not come around, we wouldn't have been detected. So, what I might do is kill that guy anyway. Because I was kind of trying to avoid killing people unless I absolutely had to. Um... Oh, shoot. I don't remember what path I took. Well, he didn't detect me, so it's okay. Connor, what's going on? What are you going to do behind that skinny tree when you're a giant human? <laughs> what is he going to do, huh? Yes, I remember coming this way. And then... Oh, come on. Okay. And then... I did come this... Oh. Wait a second, this guy coming. I climbed this, that's what it was. And then I came into the haze that there. I will wait because that guy's coming. Of course, what I could do. No, not your brother. Okay. 
I'll wait till that guy is turning around. <laughs> there are all sorts who will betray and manipulate you. You know what I'm doing. Shoot, the guy's over there. Shoot, come on! Ugh. Like, is that part that I'm not sure what to do about just yet? Something about my screen rate looks like it's lagging. I don't know what it is. It might be because you know, I think I know why. It might pause my recording, and check to see if that's done yet. Because, Kurt, because how I have to do these. <gasps> Videos was also be happy to edit them after I actually record the video. Meaning, like, um, I have to crop the videos after I'm done with done with the recording. Um, and currently. I am having one of my videos being downloaded because I edited it and I think that might be what's disgracing my screen rate. That's my guess. Okay. We're we're out of place. Okay. You seek land to enough. Land that is not yours, nor any person. Yeah, I'm not gonna worry about killing that guy. And we'll see about killing this guy. And now I'm going to shoot, come on. No. The heck's happening? Hopefully that video will be done fixing itself soon. Okay. They detect you so fast. Scan the brush. No, get in there. I'm worried about moving. So I shall wait. My fact, I think I'm gonna just kill this guy. If I can. I'm gonna get deeper in the brush.
There we go. Okay. Come on! Just get the heck out of here. At the very least, there's a not notorious range, like right there. Goodness gracious, they detect you so fast. So, I should probably get to the trees. Get back in the brush. I don't think that guy is going to be able to see me, but I'm seeing two of them, and they're both coming closer to this way. Uh, to coming around this bend. Oh, great. There's one coming. Oh, shoot. There's a whole cohort. Uh, what, cohort? Yeah, that's the word. Okay. So, okay, they're walking away now. Oh, well, we got to the area. Pierce. Pierce. Have I not always been an advocate? Have I not always sought to protect you from harm? If you wish to protect us, then give us arms, muskets, and horses that we might defend ourselves. War is not the answer. We remember, Stanwicks. We remember you moved the borders. Even today, your men dig up the land, showing no regard for those who live upon it. Your words are honeyed, but false. We are not here to negotiate, nor to sell. We are here to tell you and yours to leave these lands. <laughs> so be it. I offered you an olive branch, and you knocked it from my hand. Yeah, because we don't want you taking Perhaps our freaking land. Better to the sword. Are you threatening us? <laughs> yes. You poor. Okay. No. Ugh! That's literally everything I didn't want to do. What the heck? Restart. Restart checkpoint. Because at least we got you a checkpoint. And you don't want a single native to die. So I had to basically kill Johnson without being detected. Well, where the fudge? Okay, so it's this way. Why the heck am I over here? What? So, what, I have to move fast enough before he does anything? Or was I detected? Because shouldn't what it looks like is if you detect it, he'll kill one of them. But you know, that's logical. Well, no, it's not. But I can see where the game's coming from. Still go. What? Whatever. an end to your schemes you sought to claim these lands for the templars i that we might protect them do you think the good king george lies awake at night 
hoping that they'll harm comes to his native subjects. Either the people of the city care one whit about them, or sure, the colonists are happy to trade when they need food or shelter, or a bit of extra padding for their armies. But when the walls of the city constrict, when there's crops that need soil, when there's... when there's no more enemy to fight, we'll see how kind the people are then. The colonists have no quarrel with the Iroquois. Not yet. The Quah. But they will. Tis the way of the world. In time, they'll turn. I... I could have stopped it. I could have saved you all. You speak of salvation, but you were killing them. Yeah. I, because they would not listen. And so... That's not how you do that, buddy. Neither will you. Yeah, no. What is happening? I can't see. Oh, shoot. I was trying to take a human shield, but whatever. Oh my gosh. A slap hurt me that much. Oh shoot. Oh, come on. I don't know if it's I don't know what's happening. Like usually when you are able when you counter attack cuz it looks like those are are um equivalent to the brutes, the guys with the blue jackets. And it's usually So I guess I need to break their defenses first and then attack them. But if I go for the kill, it's just like, oh, you get hurt anyway. It does such a say escape the area. Let me do that. Cause this is, this is a losing battle. This is pointless. Oh shoot, don't do that. <laughs> My gosh, I was trying to do the eagle dive or whatever you call it. Like, I want to fight them, but I don't know. Maybe because my computer is so slow. I don't understand how to defeat those big guys. These guys, I got. Simple. Brave defense. Come on.
Oh gosh. Just get far away from him. Great job, you killed your own guy. Let me change to my firearm. Yeah, it's still not working. I don't understand. Those big guys are really annoying. Oh, come on, Connor. What the fudge? You could have climbed that. Whatever. Let's just get out of here. Oh, there's a treasure chest, though. Look, they're so annoying. Like, I wish I could understand how to defeat them. But I don't. Oh, come on now. Performance. What? My gosh. And then it's just going to tell you to get an optional, to get um, full sing. You need to do a swan dive, whatever, to escape. I didn't see that at all. I am not getting this fighting... At least with the big guys. Like the smaller guys, they make more sense. It's literally just your counter slash parry. And then you attack them. What's going on? Simple as that. But like with the blue guys, I don't even know. Like I guess the breaking defenses thing worked. But the problem is another... If another one attacks you immediately, I can't counter fast, fast enough because he's breaking the defenses of the other guy. What in the world is happening? Why aren't you working? What? Let me restart last checkpoint because I don't know what's wrong with it. Maybe I can get the full sync. <laughs> so yeah, it does say I don't have to... F okay, secret search completed. Lovely. You can continue on now. Thank you. William Johnson is dead, and with him, the Templar plot to steal the land of my people. But in ending this threat, I have revealed another. On his body was a letter addressed to John Pitcairn, containing orders to root out and destroy Patriot weapons and supply. Should he succeed in this, the colonists will be unable to maintain their resistance, and the Templars will surely take control. So long as Pitcairn lives, the danger remains. I need to find him. He needs to die. All right. I thought it might bring clarity or instill a sense of accomplishment, but all I feel is regret. And confusion. Hold fast to that. Such sacrifices must never come lightly. I had to do it. Not only for my people, but for all the others Johnson would have harmed. It's a start. But to truly be free of Templar influence, all of them must be dealt with in turn. Even your father. I know. Don't you speak the words. But do you believe them? Seems we've company. Uh oh. That's a very odd way to say it. Seems we've company. I never would have thought of saying what we've is? in that f sentence. A request for aid from Paul Sounds Reed. weird. Seems the Redcoats are up to something in Boston. As always. Yes, you made an impression on the Sons of Liberty. They mistake Yay? me for one of their own. Please tell Mr. Revere he has my sympathies, but I cannot help at present. Why not? You might wish to reconsider. John Pitcairn is mentioned by name. Where am I to go? <laughs> Mr. Revere's house in Boston. If you'd like, I can... But... Sheesh. He's a man with a mission. All right. I mean, good, good, good for you. Animal spirit outfit. 
Yeah, I do have some outfits now, probably. Let's go look at those, I suppose. I'm curious. Oh, we have poison darts now. I gotta remember where is the place he showed me. Uh oh. Because I've only been down there once. Oh, yeah, it was like right here. Here we go. Can you make sure you close the door? All right. Oh. Oh, whoa. What? They have... Isn't that the rogue outfit? No, not, not that. Not that one. Not that garbage. This one. That looks like the rogue outfit. And that's Edward's outfit. Why he keeps pointing at that one? I'm not looking at that one. You dunk off. <laughs> wow. Raggy. So, doing... What do you need to do to unlock these outfits? Oh, you probably have to like... Oh, so now we have... Ezio's outfit. We now have this one. Oh, so we do have a couple of the outfits now. Yeah, that is the um the rogue outfit. A outfit worn by a colonial assassin converted into a member of the Templar Order. It's like they gave a um a glimpse. Oh, we now have this one. Was this one worn by a Nord Victor Dorian who was a member of the French Brotherhood of the Assassins during the French Revolution Revolution. So that's probably um um Unity. Bayux. Let's see, worn by Bayux. One of the last Medjay of Egypt and the co-founder of the first Assassin Brotherhood. The something ones. Oh, this was one by Wade Hagedun. An alternate reality where George Washington became king. Ha! And they have the assassin outfit. I'm curious. What does he look like in this? Probably silly. Oh, it's very white. It's very white. Yeah, no, that doesn't fit him at all. Uh, like, he's not, he's not fluffy and flurrying like Ezio is. He's definitely more of a rugged woods looking person this this is perfect for him this matches him more all right I'm gonna get out of here so we're going to see about what was his name P pitern pickern mm -hmm. let's see what's in this area though i wonder if this is available now we shall try it. Might get mauled by a wolf. But we shall try. Um, I'm going to take the horse. Oh, you you can't you can't can I ride this horse? Yes, I can. Let's see. Let's 
see if we can come down this hill. Tree after tree. Alright. Try not get lost in the forest with a horse. But I know you can get to there. You're not that big. There we go. Got a clearing now. And my hope is wolves won't be as much of a problem. Oh, yeah. This is the one that's like really high up a hill. Okay, let's look around now. Uh, let's see. Sorry, horse. You're mad at me now. He's like, I can't go up there. Leave me alone. All right. Thanks. I think. I think we're getting somewhere. I think. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Oh, it's a moose. Or elk. I think. Um. Okay. All right, this is promising. This this looks climbable. Oh, you gotta be joking, Connor. Are you joking, Signore? I I assure you, you can climb that. Like as soon as I get on top of this giant hill, we good. He starts like he can't climb that. Boy, if you don't get yourself up there. This is the most complicated trinket ever. Like, there's got to be a point where I can climb it. Okay. Climb it. Oh my gosh. You can climb that. I'm just running around along this freaking wall like an idiot. How is going down going to help me? Okay, actually that might help me. <laughs> Let's see. Because we've been to this area before. That was, that's, this is stupid. There were so many points he could have climbed up. What is this garbage? Hello. Can I, I, can I climb up this maybe? Boy, you know, get yourself up there. You can't climb? Oh my gosh. Why are there so many things along this freaking mountain that with a freaking trinket, you can't climb? Like, so many of those, he should be able to climb. So why are they acting like, mm, actually, he can't. Sorry. Just like, yes, he can. He, even, he was able to climb things I had no idea he could possibly ever climb. But things that are clear, he should be able to climb. Like this right here. Like, he should be able to climb this. But he can't. What? Their pattern on what this man can climb and cannot climb makes no sense. Because literally, I just need to get up this freaking mountain. Once I'm on top of this mountain, I think... Yeah, I can just... Yeah, all that... Like, I'm guessing once I get up here, I can just run this way. That's my guess, because it all looks like the same mountain, unless I'm crazy. Like, how in the world are you supposed to get up there? And going down is not helping me. I mean, this is something, I guess. But if you remember right, I jumped off a cliff. 
So this is probably just leading me to the exact same mountain I was already on. And it's like all the way over there. How in the world do they expect you to get this thing? Why didn't you whoa? Oh, it's a beaver. Okay. I thought it was a tiny bear. Oh, the little beaver's around. That's crazy. Like, what? This is probably one of the most confusing trinkets I ever had the displeasure of trying to get. Because I am telling, like, it's on the top of that giant mountain. Nah, I'm, I'm in it now. I really want this. I don't know how I managed to stray from the mountain that it's on top of so much. Because I was literally just following the edge of the mountain. Okay, you see that? That that looks like something I can do. Okay, I'm looking that way. Cause it look it looks like you might be able to jump over there from here. That's my guess. Let's try it. I but it points downwards. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. And he gonna act like he can't climb this. Oh my. I am so frustrated. This makes no dang sense. He should be able to climb this mountain range. But they're acting like, mm, actually, no. He sucks. He can't. I am so freaking frustrated. He's been able to climb the dumbest things. And they're gonna sit here and freaking tell me he can't climb that small thing. Cause it's right there. What the heck? And that doesn't work cause it's too low. Guys, I don't care about y'all. Just go do your things. And this entire side of the mountain is, yeah, no, we're not, we can't climb that. I know that for a fact. There has to be a point where this mountain shallows. It's not that. Okay, wait a second, what's that? It looks like. It looked like the mountain was lowering. This is still all the same mountain. And now we're heading down. There has to be a point he can climb up. I am so confused. Why the heck are they acting like? See, why did he climb that? You remember that mission we did where the dude was at the top of the freaking mountain? 
See, he should be able to climb that. Oh, but you can climb that. That makes no dang sense. This is stupid. This is freaking stupid. I am so mad right now. It doesn't make any sense. The continuity isn't there. There are some places on the mountain he was able to climb with ease. And I'm finding places that look exactly like that. If not more conducive to being able to climb. And they're going to sit here and say, actually, no, he can't climb any of that. Because that's obviously what they're expecting you you're to do. Because you literally can't do anything else. They are expecting you to climb up this thing somehow. This takes so much time. I should play the game. I know. But I'm just so frustrated. I just want to... And, like, this mountain never gets lower. There was, like... I don't understand why he climbed any part of this mountain. Okay, now climb. Climb. Why can't he climb it? Bruh, it's right there. I want to punch somebody. It makes no sense. He can't climb any part of this. Now what the hell is that sound? Is that why? Because the area isn't available to us? My gosh, I don't understand. Now we're all the way over here. <laughs> it makes no sense. It makes no sense that you can't freaking climb up that mountain literally anywhere. Especially when you think about that mission we did. We, with the, we did the homestead mission. We saved the guy and we literally climbed the mountain. We climbed the mountain. We climbed, I think, that exact mountain. And now they're going to see and tell me, actually, every single part of this plastic mountain, you cannot climb up. It looks no different. Again, there's some places on this mountain that look so much more conducive to being able to climb than the parts that we, than the parts that we climbed when we saved the dude in the homestead mission. Like, especially when that last place we got to, like, it was so low. If he would just run up the wall, he would be there. And I don't even think that the area, it's because the area isn't available to us. I think it's because it just, they're idiots and they don't know how to make a freaking climbing mechanic. <laughs> because even when an area wasn't available yet in, like, AC Brotherhood, whatever, you can still climb it. You would just be in risk of being desynchronized. But in this case, it doesn't let you climb it, period. So that means they're saying, hey, this whole thing currently, or this whole thing, you cannot climb, no matter what. See, why can't you climb that, but not literally any other part of that mountain that we were on to? It looks the exact same. There's nothing different. It leads to a whole other area we haven't been to yet. So it's not like it's not a fully realized area. You know? I don't know. 
and I'm annoyed that sometimes let me just fall down. Sometimes he's able to do the whole run thing where he runs to the tree. Oh, wait a minute, wait a past the tree. To um, the next branch, but then sometimes he doesn't. I don't. I'm not entirely sure what makes it so that he does do it. That was the most frustrating, like 10, 15 minutes of my life. Well, no, that's not true. But it was very frustrating. Now I gotta get up this giant mountain, rather. So I think out of all the terrain video games of all the all of the terrain of the AC games I've dealt with. This is my least favorite. <laughs> it's just so difficult trying to get literally anywhere. Because you have places that are on tops of freaking hills and... Do I climb up this? Oh no, you can't climb up this because it's not conducive to climbing. Oh, but he can he can actually run up this, huh? Bastards. <laughs> See, like look at this. That should be climbable. So now they figure out how to get up on this fucking freaking hill. I hate these mountains. It's official. I hate the mountains in this game. I have to sit here and spend God knows how long trying to figure out how the heck you can get up them. See, what's the difference between this section of mountain and the other section of mountain I was trying to climb up before? I mean, I almost here. I hope so. I'm so tired of dealing with this place. Okay, it looks like at the very least the mountain is lowering. Okay, I think we found our little. Yes, we have. Why can't there be something like this for the other mountain that we're worried about? Makes no sense. <sighs> okay, so I need to go to the frontier. I want to say until I need to go up even higher. I hope not. No, we're getting close to where we need to be. Well, sorry about that. I was really thinking we would get the peg leg thing. I was thinking, oh, we can get it now. But the game said, nope, screw you. Yeah, it's travel to the frontier. Oh man, I should fast travel. I should find a harbor master. Oh no. I should have found a harbor master. Because I need to go to Boston. I must say, um, the traveling mechanics and methods in this one are a little more bothersome than the others. It's like you're saying you're saying there's a fast travel around here, but like Should I be going up? I can't remember. Okay, I feel like I went the wrong direction the last time I came here. And last time I went um I mean this is leading to something. Let's click cause it should appear on my map. So this is oh there's a fast travel, but that's not exactly what I need. So I need to go shoot, there's a lot of stuff in the frontier you can deal with actually. 
go trying to ride all the way to the harbor master wouldn't be worth it that's a waste of time so i would have to i need to turn around and and i do need to go down only thing is um Yeah, they should have more harbor masters closer by. I feel like. Looks like we're going the right direction now. Uh, surprisingly. This horse is. I got it to help with the travel, but it's actually being kind of annoying. Like, where the fudge am I? So I need to get all the way over there. So. This map also isn't very helpful, I feel like. No! Oh gosh. I'm leaving you, horse. Sorry. Okay, so this is where the mission happened. Okay. What do you want? What do you want? Why are people detecting me? Mind your business. Oh, because I have slight notoriety. Screw off. <laughs> Gosh. See, how would I have gotten over here with the horse? Oh, it's a freaking bear. Oh, gosh. Shoot. Great. Oh gosh, there's another one. Guess we're in bear country now. Run! Oh, come on! Oh, come on! This is so freaking annoying. I hate these things. Deer with them is so annoying. Ugh, freaking bears. All I'm trying to do is get to my next checkpoint. Why is this so difficult? This fast travel, and the thing is their fast travel really isn't fast travel. Like, can I? Oh my gosh, guys. I didn't know you could do that. <laughs> I am so mad at myself. I didn't know you could do that. Dang it, had I known I would have been here already. Wouldn't have to worry about some freaking bears. Gosh, well, at least now I know.
That's actually stupid helpful. Like, insanely helpful. <laughs> Why didn't I think about that? I guess I... Because usually when you fast travel, you have to... Um, yes, go to Boston. Usually in the other games, to fast travel, you had to um, get to a designated fast travel area. And then you can only fast travel to a particular place, like usual. I guess they changed that. Which is nice. I feel like we did a whole lot of nothing thus far. Oh, I could fast travel to right there? Really? Well, we made it. Took 10 years, but we did. Mm, it's a fortress. <sighs> well, this was frustrating. Went from <sighs> gay developer telling you you can't freaking climb things that should be very, very much climbable. And um, then me running around like a fool trying to, to travel like literal like hundreds of miles. <laughs> Let's grab this viewpoint. Shall we? I don't think we've grabbed the viewpoint since we started playing as Connor. Oh gosh, this was very annoying, this playthrough. <laughs> yeah, but I don't, I don't get there climbing with the mountains and all that stuff. It makes no sense. Oh, get back up there. Looks like he does a cross foot thing. It's funny how his running makes the dogs. <gasps> Who's that little dog minds? <clears throat> Goodness, how far is this thing? Oh gosh! Okay, wait a second. Hold up. Perfect. Alright, took 10 years. He's all old now. Connor. Easily in his 70s, probably by now after all that traveling. But we, we finally, we finally made it. Let's hope this mission is exciting. To oh, why is he so mad? To introduce you to William Dawes and Robert Newman. Your letter said John Pitcairn was here. Aye. He's readying an assault on Lexington, where Adams and Hancock have taken shelter. After that, he will march on Concord, hoping to destroy our weapons and supplies. You must help us. Only tell me where to find him, and I will put a stop to this. 
He has dozens, if not hundreds, of soldiers at his command. You cannot hope to match him by yourself. That's true. But fear not, that you will not have to. We have an entire army of our own, merely awaiting the order to take up arms. Then you must call upon them. Indeed. You and I <laughs> cross the Charles River and rouse the boys. William, I need you to take the overland route and do the same. Robert, I need you up in Christchurch. Like the signal, two lanterns, our enemy comes by sea. No time for dawdling, my friend. We yeah, start talking. Start starting him. <laughs> just don't touch him. <laughs> I, Kyra just like, don't touch me. Paul River tries again, don't touch me. I wonder why he's so upset though. Like, you know, he thinks you're like a brethren. And you're like, get your hands off me. I guess because he's a colonist like everyone else. I don't know. Frontier. April 18th, 19, 1775. They've only left a single horse. We'll have to ride together. I, I'm good. You take the reins, I'll navigate. Quickly, Connor, get on the horse. He's so tired. He looks so mad. Connor, calm down. Is he in his grumpy teenage years? <laughs> He's hitting I'll the... you towards those we need to alert. Follow my directions, and we'll be done in no time. Do not trigger open conflict. Go left up here. Connor is not having Paul Revere's mess at all. He wants nothing to do with him. He's really sad. Paul, he looks like a nice person. He's very nice. Yes, this is exactly where we need to be. Okay. Redcoats. What are they doing here? Which way? They must be scouts. Be careful, Connor. We mustn't let them warn the others. So... Which way am I going, though? I, I, I guess I'm going this way. To the right, Connor! To the right! My bad. Goodness, you have to yell at me. The fox just seems to be sweet little buddies. So far so good. Go left up here. Okay. Oh wait, no, he Might said be left. Might safer if we approach the houses on foot. All right. Yeah, they're trying to detect me. I like you, Paul. People want to kill me. To where now, Senora? Do we follow them? Find the first militia house. So it's somewhere in this area. 
that. Is it? No. <laughs> There's just something up there. This is it. You have got the right place. Okay. Let everyone know that the regulars marked for Lexington and Concord. You're very loud. The are coming. Back in the saddle, my friend. We have more people to warn. <sighs> okay, Paul. Go left up here. We can't afford to be discovered, Connor. Hide. Ah! We saw your point. You know, in my previous playthroughs, I said, oh, I'm not going to try too hard for full synchronization. But then, like, every time I, I get the chance, I, um, I restart <laughs> the checkpoint. This way, Connor! Stop yelling. All right, we have to stop soon. <laughs> oh, shoot, it's late. I need to get ready for work soon. Well, kind of come over already dressed. I just need to get all my stuff together. Brush my teeth. Oh man. Wouldn't surprise me if we ran into more trouble. Stay and alert. I, I can't. Mm. Yes, this is it. This is the way. Okay. Goodness, it's gonna be Christmas before we know it, y'all. Ah, then it's gonna be over before we know it. <laughs> when I was younger, I used to get very excited for the holidays, but now that I'm older and older and time goes by so quickly. Go left up here. It's like, I don't know, it's just like, ah, oh, it's Christmas, ah, oh, it's New Year's. Oh my gosh, it's July 4th already again. You know? Be on the lookout for red coats. Aye, aye. Does any of this look familiar to you, Connor? To the left, Connor! So I have to go back? There was no left. There wasn't a path. There's no... Turn right! Uh, this way? I believe we are on course. This is the course? No way. You're lying to me. I have made this crossing a dozen times. Why is everything suddenly so foreign? Pressure must be getting to me. Wouldn't surprise me if we ran into more trouble. Stay alert. Ain't no way this is... To the left, Connor! Okay, here we go. It's like there's no path. What do you mean? Left. He still pointed as if we're in the wrong place. You know what? We're gonna get on this bridge and we're gonna see what happens. How about it? Wrong way, Connor! I know. Give me a minute. Did you hear that? Could be red coats. Careful. 
Yes, this is exactly where we need to be. Am I going to the left now? I believe we are on course. Okay. Which way? Go right, Connor. Okay. I believe we are on course. This way, Connor. Wouldn't surprise me if we ran into more trouble. Stay alert. Turn right. He said, turn right. Let us continue the search on foot. This is it. You have got the right place. That was fast. All right, this is going to be the last one that we do for today. Spread the word. The regulars are coming out. At once! Why are you yelling? Calm down. All right. Well, this was a hot mess. I ran around like a madman. I still can't figure out those freaking fight mechanics against the big blue guys. Like, right when I think I'm getting better at this game, the game shoves a knife into my stomach, twists it, and knocks me down to the ground just like, you know nothing, shrimp. Like, I'm trying. Come on. Give me some break. <sighs> this is very frustrating, but hopefully, hopefully we can do better next time. Sorry for um, running around with my head cut off, trying to find a way to get that freaking trinket. When I should have been able to climb that mountain. I'm going to be so mad about that for God knows how long. But, you know, maybe I'll get over it. Alright, so that is it for this playthrough. Thank you for watching, suffering along with me, and I will catch you on our next video. Bye-bye.